Hey everyone, I forgot to reset the recording, so, um, yeah, uh, that video is gonna be extra long because I don't feel like editing it. Alright, are there fights here though? That's the real question. I like this music though. It kind of reminds me of, um, the runes in FF11 that you go to. Well, this is the question about monsters. There are a lot of them. Alright. Guess we'll start with a Lambda Burst. And a Quilek. We're we gonna play Quetya? Is Quetya the Gigas? She can just wipe those out. That'll make it easier to choose selections. Up to hit. It looks like, yeah, it looks like she can. So, hitting the other targets will be the. Oh, I thought. All right, well, good counter. Now we get our main attack. Good job, Jackman. All right, we're doing it. So the uh, the dogs have a lot more HP and they don't seem particularly weak to fire, but that's okay. Jackman's getting closer and closer to blue and green. Alright, what do we got here? We can go that way. Go that way. Uh, let's go this way. So it looks like it's possibly gonna lead to a dead end, which could mean treasure. It can also not mean treasure. Who knows? That's part of the fun. Oh, I know about these, though. I didn't even see the dog back there. What the fuck? I say dog, but it was actually probably a, more of a deer. Maybe a cross between the two. It's got the antlers and like a fucking deer-like head wearing a mask. I think it's born with the mask. Oh, that looks like a treasure chest right there. One I can't get to, but it looks like one. Okay. Those three spawn. What? Why is that one? Okay, that one looks more like a dog than the others. A fair lift. Like I said, you're gonna see this skill a lot going forward, guys, because it's just the easiest to spam move. That one's guarding, okay. He's dead. Damn it, it's still guarding. Oh, now it's dead. Yeah. 
That one was not guarding, but it did die. All the same. <laughs> I'm with Faith. I would love to see a modern uh, redo of this game. And then, what? go okay that takes me to the other side break on through through to the other side oh, back attack why do I always get back attacked by whenever there's like 70 enemies in the fight okay well more like five but soon to be like 70 this seems very langry Five has become seven. Thank God for Lambda Burst. Fire consumed my enemies! Lambda Burst! I mean, I liked my Pyre box, but this is even better. One of them actually lived. Athena's like, I'm gonna take. Oh, he was guarding, that's why. Damn defense options. That was fun! That was fun! Ah, Vice is gonna level up soon. Does anybody know what the average uh, level someone's on when they get to the end of this game? Like I said, I haven't really done any grinding. I, I, I got a little money after stream one day, and that was a reason crystal walked through. this area and we are not back attack this time so yeah. actually we got the back attack it looks like it looks like we uh got the preemptive strike this time the tables of tables so I don't think any of them could possibly be guarding nope they're all dead easy peasy is it over already? I want another uh, Moonberry to see what the next skill that. Uh... Oh, there's my level. Hey, green rank up. He learns Noxie. Wait, you only know two green spells, dude? That's it? Or is that the third? Man. Oh, yeah, he only knows two. He only knows two. One, three. He doesn't know any yellow yet. Oops. That's fine, though. There you go. The team has been healed up a little. I'm kind of surprised I have not found a Moonfish or a Cham yet, though. I feel like if there's going to be a Cham anywhere, it'd be here. You know? Like, this feels like a place where there'd be a bit of a moonstone. Fire my Especially since moonstones rained down upon this place back in ancient times. Drachma levels up! 115 more HP, 3 more power. 
Alright, let's see here. Vice is nowhere near getting any of these. Closest is purple. Aika is nowhere near getting any of these. Actually, no, she is near. She's close to getting uh, silver. Fina is closest to getting another green. And he's closest to getting a purple. So all of them are gonna get a purple. Possibly when Vice gets his. Not necessarily though. Because Vice gets purple faster than the others because he's using it on his weapon. This fight's actually pretty decent EXP and money, so because I got another back attack, I'll get the first hit. And then she's able to wipe them all out because none of them can defend. There we go. We did it. Serves them right. Serves them right. Oh, there's my other Moonberry. Okay, guys, we got it. Tina. Silver Moonlight cleanses all allies of any adverse effects except unconscious. All right, we'll get it, but it's not the best one. Now for you, I guess. You already got two, you got three, you got three. All right, we're gonna get you your third and final one. That sound is interesting. Stone cutter. Is that for you? It is. A blade originally used in masonry work. It has since been modified for use in combat. It's Twelve more attack power. Okay, so one thing I really like in RPGs is when they put useful shit in treasure chests. It feels more rewarding to go around and find a useful weapon in a treasure chest than it does to go and find a fucking high potion here or there. Especially if they put a monster in a chest and it's got a high potion in it. That's irritating. Oh. What the heck? That looks like, um... Let's see how much damage Lambda Bears does. I'll have you attack that, I'll have you attack that. Over there. Fire I'm not saying this how much damage Flame lands. First. Looks like a giant sloth, but also a mix with some something from a horror movie I saw a while ago. Uh, back probably with Wintry. Okay, so that did 291 damage and did like nothing to his health. Oh good, okay. I'll take a counterattack. Uh okay. So Quake is a thing and it hurts probably. That hurts a lot, what the fuck? 600 damage? Okay, this thing sucks. Moons, give me strength. I wonder if I can turn it to stone. Let's try this. Okay, guys, stop missing. This thing's gigantic. How the fuck do you miss? Thank you. 
Okay, that did fuck all. Here goes. Also did fuck all. It's like a boss. I am gonna have her, uh, I can heal herself still though. I'm not gonna have you use, uh, Lunar Glyph. Then we can turn into stone. Of course you counter attack. Why wouldn't you? Stone. All right, now that I got enough points, I'm gonna have. Uh... I think this is the first time something's ever counterattacked me twice in, a, in one round. Oh, he's gonna heal. Great. On well, his is 400, because of course it does. this enemy. He takes forever to die. Slightly more than he can heal. Of course, he counters. Sucked. I didn't like that. Ah, oh, shit. The Aiko is telling the truth. Oh, treasure over here. Sacrulin crystal. Even better than the sack. This is gonna take me all the way back to the start. If it does, I don't want to get off. Takes me back to the start, that's good.
Okay, good. I'll take this fight. suck apparently sorry I checked uh, the stats on that sloth and I mean apparently they just suck this music reminds me of FF11 and FF9 Let's see these, uh, see better days, it seems. You know what, X? You're right. It is a little bit odd that they, those floating platforms didn't erode over time. What the fuck? What the hell? Zivil and Bane. Alright. Okay. I did, like, no damage to his health. What the fuck? Over there. Like, I'm doing nothing to him, what the hell? How you doing, X? Okay. Like, at least that made a noticeable dent in his health. Let's try this. Okay, can you stop counterattacking like every round, dude? Alright, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to Cutlass Fury, I'm going to have you, I'm going to have you, Lunar Glyph, and I'm going to have you attack. Alright. Nice chunk of damage. And maybe we might be able to turn him to stone. Is he eating lunch? No, every other monster in this in the place has been. No, okay, most of the other monsters in this place have been manageable, but this guy just I don't know where that's hit me for a thousand. Like what? And then he counterattacks again, because why wouldn't he? Let me guess, it's gonna hit. Thought so. That's another thing I don't like about this game is I don't know how to move my characters around, and yet they all just group up for no fucking reason. They enemies start doing shit like that. And there's nothing you can do about it. Like, I, w I wouldn't place my characters this close to each other if I knew it was going to stop. Uh, if I knew it was going to get them to get hit by multiple things. Yeah. Oh, now he's guarding. Good. Watch him use burst again. 
Oh, he can't because he's guarding, but he got an extra. He gets some counterattack, though, of course. I knew he was gonna throw another one of that, one of those fucking things at. Apparently, it's very bad to run away in this game. They stressed early on that it was not not something you should ever do. But if the game keeps giving you fights like that, why would you ever want to stay in them? This takes way too long. Mega seed, though. That could be good. I don't know about you guys, but I'm not a huge fan of random battles taking super long amounts of time. I forget what I got in that. Oh, Golden Mask, great. Right. I'm wondering if it was because I clicked on the treasure chest, and if that's the case, I might just not grab any treasure chests in this area. Okay. Was well, not because I clicked the treasure chest. Theory tested. Okay, so that's a new enemy over there. I know most of these. Toll and pulls are really weak, so we can lambda burst these fucks. This thing has a design that tells me it's probably gonna suck, but it died pretty easily. We did it! We did do it. Thank you, Fina. And Ika levels up. More HP. Our silver spells are gonna be even closer soon. Sorry guys, I'm uh, exploring a bit more because I have... There's a champ nearby. Like I said, this has got to be a place where I find a champ, right? It makes sense. There we go. Alright, this has got to be the one that evolves us, right? We've eaten like six champs. Alright, uh, increases max MP by one. Uh, let's give that two. It's a cupel sword now. Not a cupel blade, but a cupel sword. Alright, so the only way forward that I can see... The music here kind of reminds me of Bermesia. I ultimately really like it. Uh, it's just... I'm not a huge fan of uh, random battles taking fucking forever. Boss fights? Okay, they can take they can take a while, that's fine, whatever. I can deal with that. But random battles? Ugh. Anyway, back there. It's especially bad in the older JRPGs when it does that because of uh, 
the delays and such between attacks, especially if they have attacks that take a long animation. I'll mix your bag. Attacks vector. These totems are pretty good EXP though. Oh, I got another Moonberry, sick. Um, yeah, so if I get one more, I can probably teach uh, one or two more. I can probably teach uh, Drachma his, his third. That side now. It's thoroughly my has been thoroughly mi mixed, and my day is now ruined. You shall ruin this day. Hey, there's my second moonberry. Look at that. The game just wanted me to have moonberries today. Okay. Hang on, after we uh, try to teach him his super move. No, looks like he needs another moonberry for that next one, so. Okay. So, we're gonna reset our recording.